Hi, it's just me again. Um, I'm with a wee reading for you. And as always, take it if it uh, resonates with you. And if not, it may be relevant to someone you know. And the card that came out this time was dependability. Uh, so the, the message of it is straightforward. And uh, the timing of it is confirmed by the dark running down the entire length, both sides. Uh, right between the two eclipses, the solar eclipse on the left of the card just passed. Sorry, the lunar eclipse on the left of the pa card just passed. And the solar eclipse on the right, which is coming in uh, in just over a week's time, uh, 8th of April. So dependability. Stay grounded, stay focused and true to yourself. You are completely in touch with all the masculine and feminine, feminine aspects of yourself. Both of these figures are you. They're the same person. They're showing that you're in touch with every aspect. Um, don't be taken in by fancy ideas, unfounded gossip, or misinformed opinions. The dogs in the street really don't know what they're talking about. It's Chinese whispers. So uh, stick to fact, stick to what you know, stick to your own truth, and draw from your own life experience, your own lived experience, and you won't go far wrong. In the card, you can see that your God is far red, lit up. You are, your intuition is uh, on fire, spot on. Listen to it. Pay attention to it. Uh, and as I said, the time confirmed by the eclipse is running down each side. Eclipses are generally a time of change, and this card uh, also has a message that change is fast approaching. Embrace it. It'd be positive, providing you stick to your own decisions. Now, the message confirmation of the message actually comes from the beautiful lily, which is in full bloom in your hands. Um, and you might notice too that uh, although you've got gentle hands, you also have a fist there just above the gentle hands. So you have that uh, determination within you that uh, some people might miss, but you have it. Um, and at the top uh, center, the entire card is crowned by a large black bat. Um, not a baseball bat, but a bat as you would get flying around church spars and stuff at night. Um, so anyway, the black bat actually symbolizes a very strong, one of the strongest symbols of the cycle of life and death. Now that doesn't mean someone's going to pass, but rather that change is inevitable and something important uh, for you is fast approaching. Sorry about the shaky hand, had to move the page there. Um, so, uh, within each of your male and female uh, heads there is uh, an eye where your ear would normally be. And that's showing that your uh, sixth sense your intuition is currently very keen. Um, because these eyes are in the place where your ear should be, you know, it's saying, listen carefully, visualize what you hear, what you're being told before making decisions that are your decisions and that sit comfortably with you. You know, just don't, don't take things at face value. Think them through for yourself. And uh, both, if you look closely at uh, the hair, uh, you will see that both the male and the female heads are crowned by turtles. 
knitted into your hair there, um, which which symbolizes and shows clearly that past loved ones are very much with you, supporting you, looking after you. Um, so you you made a sense that yourself. Now, if you look down the eclipse on the right, the approaching eclipse is a black dog, and then. That's sort of level with the bottom of your hair, and then about an inch down below that, it's also a black cat. Now the black dog is guidance and protection, which confirms the message of the turtles. And the black cat reinforces is also spiritual protection, but um, the black cat is also uh, a symbol of health, wellness, uh, positivity going forward so uh, the sky if you look up the top of the card again then the sky to the left if I can I'm not sure if you'll see it in the camera but anyway I can see it uh, so I'll tell you uh, the sky on the left probably contains a very large face of an owl wisdom Again, reinforcing strong intuition, your own decisions will be the right ones. And just to the in the sky on the right above the female head um, is a white dog. And uh, the white dog confirms new beginnings free from any negativity or negative influences. It might be that with this new start, you've uh, let some people drift out of your life deliberately and this is telling you you're right. Um, so the white dog, new beginnings, free from negative influences of the past. So you're now sort of leveled up and uh, well settled. Know what you're about. Know what you want to do. Positive changes coming in. And you're making your own mind up on stuff. And the final confirmation, if you do that, if you stick to your own decisions and your own gut and positivity, you'll see at the bottom of right at the very bottom of the red of your gut, you've got uh, the new flowers which are approaching uh, the stage where they come into bloom. And it is spring. So it could actually be another confirmation of the time of this reading. Um, but, you know, the flowers uh, springing up at the bottom also show positive change, developing brighter times, better times lie ahead. So um, don't forget to click like um, if you like it, if it resonates with you. And uh, until it's just me again, that's just me again.